So here we are back in a brand new town as we oftentimes are and this time it really is a new town in fact all the towns on this map are new there was an apocalypse honestly it was about time this world has been around for like three weeks now it was getting kind of old and I do not find it at all. The apocalypse was actually caused by fellow player and stream watcher Killian who did it as he, the last thing he does before he stops playing the game because of real life stuff. I just want to take this opportunity to say, Killian, thank you for everything. Thank you for all the fun times on stream and goodbye and best of luck to you in your future. Hey, new babies. Oh my God. All right. I'm going to live a long life. I was going to go do some smithing, but it seems someone already is doing it instead of me. Go check the baby. Where's the baby at? Like it's, it's southeast, dude. Follow the arrow. Don't be silly. Don't be a silly dude. Don't be a silly dude. Let's see. Probably in this mining area, huh? That'd be my guess, actually. Oh my god. My grandma died. Oh no. So sad, dude. She was a good lady. You know? She was a good lady. Speaking of ladies, where's my baby at? Over here somewhere? I don't see any babies here, my dude. You don't look like a baby, auntie. You don't really look like a baby. I don't know. Whatever. Yeah, we have a lot of war, you know? That's not gonna be a problem anytime soon. Any babies over here? I, I hear some whining. There we go. Alright, cuz. Please, drop the baby down. You know what? Just, just just take this, you know? Doesn't really matter. Just take that. It's okay. Uh, we're gonna take our grandma's bones away. I'm sorry, grandma. I didn't really get to know you, you know? I was... You were already super old when I was born. You died very young. I don't really have much emotional connection to it at all. Kind of sad to say, but, you know, it's true. I have to say, like, I, our iron situation, it's its its amazing. By the way, my name is Minj Tinny. I forgot to mention that. The iron situation, it looks so good. We have so much stuff here. We don't really need... We have the bows that the lady asked for, yeah? We do. We don't need anything here, dude. We Gucci. What we should, like, focus on is getting, like, this blown to bits. So we can actually... Um, we can actually go for a diesel engine. We also have to find some oil. That shouldn't be that hard. You know, we have all that iron. Using it to find oil will not be that hard. Oh, turkey broth? Hmm, you don't say. I could go for some turkey broth, maybe. We have some palm oil. We have some sulfur. The question is, do we have any latex available in this time? Now, this, this is popcorn, dude. I really want to get it, actually. Get it. We have the ball as well. Why, why not? Berry, carrot, rabbit, pie, the ultimate combo. Yeah, we don't have latex as far as I can tell. So there there are some towns nearby. They did bring us over some resources, but we are lacking latex at this moment. Maybe we have some rubber sword somewhere. I'm gonna go take a quick look around. Maybe this road leads to a town that has latex. Yeah, that's it's entirely possible. So we don't have any latex. You know, it's kind of a shame. What can you do? What I actually can do here... We can combo some of these bad boys because I see that our loom is almost fully finished. What is here? Just bones? It's just bones. Yeah, I want to combo some of these bad boys. Do you have any other thread nearby? I don't really sure. I it should be fairly easy to get some pants. It's gonna give me an extra slot for me to uh, do stuff with. So I need to feed like what three more sheep. Be fairly easy. Alrighty, I have everything I require. I just want to make sure that no one messes with my stuff. While I'm making, I don't want anyone making a ghost costume by accident. That could be a slight disaster. All right, so let's recall how it works. We put this on, we shoot it down, get the cloth. We cut the cloth with the cloak. We use the thread to make the cloak into something useful. Like this. We gotta cut this, of course. Undyed cloak, beautiful. And then we use the thread to make the dress. Yes, don't use the shears on it, my dude. Very important. All right. Now we cut this into skirt and shirt. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. It's okay. You know what? I don't care about I don't care about uh, the, the 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 skirt that much. I really do not. We just gotta. Add. Don't you dare murderize me, dude! I see you there. Pleated skirt, and then we add some thread onto it. To get some pants. Awesome. B E A beautiful. Super easy. Super simple. Amazing. That was very easy. Again, most of the job was done by other people. And you know what? Speaking of most of the jobs, I have the uh, song skill now. So might as well just like, use it to be a bit useful. You know, people need hats. Let's give them hats. I guess I could also like wear this to be a bit fancier. But I, I, I like the warmth of, of the coat. Even though it might actually decay soon. I, uh, I, I, I like the temperature benefit more than I like anything else. And I like the pocket slots 
I, I like the pant because it both gives you temperature and gives you a, a, a pocket. I don't like the apron because uh, it does give you any temperature and also it looks very ugly because you have nothing underneath. You're wearing the apron on your bare skin, which is super creepy. Well, apparently this road doesn't lead to a different town. It leads to a well. Kind of interesting, you know, I was... I mean, it's, it's both a good thing and a bad thing because it makes us much easier to be found. Hello there, mom. Hi. <laughs> she just <laughs> went past me on a horse. I guess I should have taken a horse, huh? But uh, I was expecting, you know, there's a road here. It should be fairly easy to actually find a town. But I guess it's not a road that connects a town, dude. Let's let's get let's get some more food here over here, shall we? We have a uh, we have the bird up here. Let's put this in our pan buckets, and we can carry this over here. And a wild carrot, you know, no complaints there. Get one of those bad boys for myself as well. We don't want the seeds though, dude. What are you even doing? I do not understand myself at all. I don't know. I don't know. So yeah, we have a lot of water down south. What I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab a cart. I'm gonna grab some buckets. I'm gonna make a well kit. I'm gonna go south and I'm gonna try and like drain that southern well completely. Maybe I could like connect the north well as well. That's gonna give us like a big old area of uh, discoverability because people are gonna have a much easier time finding us because of all the dry wells. I have to say I got fairly lucky. I got a total of 13 buckets out of this well. That's like really nice. That's really good for a shallow well, dude. New offspring baby. You know what, our new offspring baby? I'm gonna go check on you in a second. Your new offspring baby is alive and well. Much love, baby, much love. You're having a good time. I like it. Alright, we're doing great. Like, we, do, we got super lucky with the well. I couldn't be happier. Don't you dare take my stuff, dude. My my stuff. No, it's my, it's my, it's my, I need that. I require that the bowl. I'm working with it right now, my dude. Chill, dude. Hey, it's a bonsai. Lovely. I knew it was there. I saw it, but you know. I haven't acknowledged it until now. Alright. What's the plan right now? Well, one, I actually drain both of these if all possible. It actually totally is, dude. Amazing. Let's uh, get this over here. Get no horse. Okay, so we have four empty buckets again. And how much room do we have in our system? This one I filled up completely. This one is almost full. This one is like half full. Not that many of them, really. Only three, huh? I think we can fill them all up. No problem. And after we're done with that, I'm gonna go explore the world a bit and find some latex for us. Okay, all of our cisterns in this town have been completely filled up. We only have three of them. That's not that many. I would have preferred more. Actually, I would prefer to have like one over here as well. So we could just like transfer stuff. Because maybe over here as well. The problem with that is it kind of gets crowded. I kind of wish this was like a bit wider. Then you offspring baby 22 meters away. They're all so close, dude. Who's this? My second cousin, I don't care about you. You're irrelevant. Oh, baby. I got you. Hello, hello, baby. All right. We'll be fine. Hello. Pick, pick, pick the baby up. Pick the baby up, dude. Pick it up. Okay. Baby hasn't been picked up. That was scary, dude. For a second, I thought I would have to intervene. This? What are you doing? You're sweet. That's a good name for a baby. It's a good name. No complaint whatsoever. Take the stuff, baby. I'll do my best to, to take care of you. At least a little bit, you know. Uh, give me actually something that you wouldn't mind wearing. Like this thing. Can you, can you take care of her? Can you take care of the baby? Do you have the power? Do you have the ability to do that? Yes. Okay. Good luck. You know what? I'm not gonna question your skills too much. I really don't want to, like, do that. All right, uh, we will need a knife for ourselves. I'm gonna ditch the mutton pie. Take this, we'll take... Uh, how, do, how many do, we, do you want to take, actually? Hold on. If you look over here, we have three sulfur and three pole bones. Well, I actually do want to take three buckets, indeed. All right, I'm gonna take three buckets. I'm gonna go explore the world a bit. Gonna hope to find some latex somewhere. That's gonna be the plan. All right, so we have a wet things over here. Now, what worries me, we are, we're the teeny family? Teeny family. Did the teeny family exist before the apocalypse? Speak of the devil. Did it exist before the apocalypse? Oh, hello there. Because if it did, that means the new families that spawned in, like the new eaves, they might be very, very far to the west. And if that's the case, that's actually kind of bad for us. I'm just going to go right here. It means no one tapped the oil yet nearby. I mean, it's probably all, all much closer to us, so that's not a problem. But yeah, like, that means we have to go roam for quite some time. Because, again, there's no bells in the world yet. 
The world hasn't existed for long enough to, for bells to actually appear. I think it's been like, what? I don't know. 10 hours? 12 hours maybe? I don't actually remember the exact time of the apocalypse. Actually, I think it's more than 10 hours. Because unless I'm mistaken, the seal coats have a decay timer of 10 hours. I might be wrong about this. And uh, I, I was wearing a seal coat and it decayed all of a sudden. So that means those things have existed for above 10, for more than 10 hours. Which means this world has existed for more than 10 hours. I think that makes sense, right? But 980 meters away from my baby. That means I'm basically a thousand tiles away from home. Yeah, there goes the marker. So I, I've been going on for quite some time. I found literally nothing. Literally zero signs of civilization so far. Which kind of tells me there is no one over here. Then the problem is there was an apocalypse and when that happens, families don't die out. Which means the Eve area, Eve spawning area, could be anywhere. Like if we were... Because it doesn't actually affect the Eve spawning area. The Eve spawning area is at the same place where it was, but people in, from... Our family who lived before the apocalypse, they were maybe far to the east, maybe like 10,000 tiles to the east when the apocalypse happened, and now we are very far away from everyone. Not sure if that's what happened here. I mean, I don't even remember if this family is pre or post apocalypse. I honestly have no idea. I, I think I saw the teeny family, but I saw the Voltaires for sure. But I'm not sure if the teeny family is a family from before the apocalypse. I could go look it up right now, like on the website. There's nothing stopping me. But I think it's like kind of more interesting to keep that a little bit of a mystery for now. I'm gonna start heading back, by the way. I'm gonna head a little bit to the south and then I'm gonna go straight east and then get back home. And you know, we maybe we'll explore to the east as well. We'll see. So we are in dry well territory yet again. I think that is dry because of our own wells. I could be completely mistaken. Let's go to the north and find one more of them, shall we? So many deserts here, dude. Oh, it's a mine. Okay. You know, that's something to keep in mind. We can come back here. Oh, boy, the snakes. We can come back here, maybe, one day. Oh, my God, this desert is endless, dude. Just give me, give me something that's not that hostile to me. There's a dry well. Again, I think it's 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 going to lead to the north. Our own town. Maybe it's a different thing entirely, though. <gasps> what is this? Like down here. That is my home. That's my home. It's definitely my home. Because we have all the sulfur and whatnot. That's not where we want to go, though. Like, maybe it's 260? Like, maybe this is not dry because of that. But we do have, uh... I think it is, actually. Because we do have the, um... We do have that extra spare well. Yeah, that, we are right here. We are right there, dude. Alright, I'm, I'm not gonna head back home just yet. You know, I'm still fairly young. Well, I'm, like, 50. But <laughs> that's still fairly young, right? Yeah, I'm still fairly young. I still have a... That mental down. By the way, I'm, I'm just like, gathering random milkweed here. Because, you know, if I'm not getting back... Any, uh, any, uh, latex? Might as well get some ropes. No one's gonna complain about a few extra ropes. Right, new baby, 6.30 away. Oh, that's a lot of milkweed, my dude. That's a lot of milkweed. Unfortunately, I won't be able to take all of it because I'm kind of full. I could leave some food behind. That's not really... Maybe, maybe I should leave a carrot behind, you know? One carrot is a small price to pay for an extra rope. I don't think anyone would dispute that. Yeah, we I've been going on for a while now, as you can probably tell, and uh, I found nothing. I think what happened here is is our family lived before the apocalypse, the apocalypse strike struck. Uh we survived, the families around us died, and new Eve belt is like 5000 tiles away to the west. Which means um we we can't really interact with them easily. We have to use horses to get there. And we kind of bone, you know. I think that's a problem with the apocalypse. Like, it, on, on a normal server restart, this would not happen. But with the apocalypse, this does happen. And that's a problem because there's a very high chance that the people in the West don't actually have any ginger families. Unless some of our people move there, which is entirely possible. I think it's entirely possible they don't have anyone. Which means, of course, that they cannot get oil. But, and um, we cannot get rubber. Maybe there's some latex somewhere, dude. Like, I, 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 would, I wouldn't be surprised if we could, like, find, like, a little mini town. Because it, 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 there has to be, like, more than one town over here that survived, right? That makes sense. I can't be, like, maybe, like, there were, like, three families in our town. I don't know. It's weird. But, again, so far, I haven't found any signs of civilization. Except uh, the that map, which I don't know who, who wrote that map. And I wish you knew who the author of the map was and when it was made, but that's maybe a little bit too much info. Scary dude. 
Don't get killed. That would be very bad. I mean, I guess we have ropes. I found a ton of iron though, which is which is great, but you know, doesn't really help our situation right now. So here's something interesting. Uh, these rabbits have already spawned. So they're not brand new. Like usually when I get to the new area, the rabbits just pop out immediately. So someone was over here before me. It might be one of my family members. It's entirely possible. Or maybe it was someone else entirely. I'm gonna go look around for a bit more. I was just gonna head home. Because again, I'm very old already. I'm, I'm actually 55 almost. So I'm gonna have to run. Okay, these ones are popping up immediately. As you can see. So like they, there was someone in this nearby area at one point. But maybe they... I'm guessing it was someone from my family with a horse who did the same thing. It's just that I got a little bit further out. Yeah, these rabbits are already here, and so I haven't actually walked in this area yet. It's weird, dude. It's weird, what can I say? We're back in dry spring territory. Again, I still think this is our our, uh, our town. Yeah, it goes to the south. It has to be it. Yep, yeah, <laughs> we're right here, dude. We're back, boys. I have returned. I've returned. Hi, are you FK, lady? I don't want to talk to you if you're FK, niece. This lady's not. I traveled far and wide. East, south, west, north. I found no signs of life. No signs of life! Zero. It's only us. It's only us. I went a thousand tiles in each direction. Thousand dollars in each direction. Found nothing. Found nothing, you know? Sucks, dude. We bound. We bound. <laughs> we will. We will carry on. We'll do our best, dude. Stuff's kooky. Stuff's crazy. You have a lot of water there, so that's that's something at least, you know? Uh I got a bunch of rubs though. I got a bunch of ropes from the wilds though six of them in fact that's something that's something you know that's okay <laughs> bring to what here the rope area is this a rope a rope down rope down you safe here you should want them here sure you know what no worries dude there we go. New offspring baby! Has been born. Don't stab people. Bunch of ropes, you know. No complaints there. You can use it for whatever you want. I'm not gonna complain about it at all. Uh, we got a bunch of these bucket boys here. I mean, I didn't make these. I just, like, brought these back. We expected. Can also that we can force upgrade a new comment. I would love to do that, actually. But uh, I know why, why you can do it, you know. I think it makes sense that you can do it. Where's the baby at? What does this say, by the way? Welcome! No no rubber will be a great city. Well, we'll try our best. Where's the baby at? This is not a baby, it's a goose! Jason, what's wrong with you, dude? That's not a baby! I don't, I don't get it. <laughs> Why does he think the goose is a baby? Maybe it actually is, mind blown. Maybe it actually is. Neff? My dude? <laughs> Let's force feed someone. That's what we do here, my niece. Beautiful. Feed her. She must be fed. She can only be fed once. It's okay. My great niece, you'll do it. Please don't die, lady. I try my best to force feed you. I'm gonna... I want to die in there. And, like, put my stuff in there. It's okay, I didn't do it. How are we doing score-wise? Eighth place? Not bad, not bad, not bad. Anyone die? No one died, dude. That's actually awesome. Because we have several offsprings. I bought my grandma and my mom. That at 860, which is noise, got a lot of points from them. 51.57, you know, complete. Actually, take a look at the leaderboards here quickly. I, I want to see where we stand right now. We are number 8, indeed. Number 7 has 51.58. So number 7 is, like, barely ahead of us. I, we're gonna be number 7 when some of our kids die, I think. Number 1 has 54.8. That's the score to beat. That sounds crazy hard. That sounds crazy, crazy hard, dude. It's gonna take a lot of work to get there, but I'm gonna do it. I'll, 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 I'll get there. I'll be number one one day. That's, that's my goal. That's indeed my goal. But yeah, I'm gonna end this one here. Thank you all so much for watching. My name's been Twisted from Hyderabad Games. Now we'll see you next time.